Yo, what's up guys? It's X-Rays and welcome to the Call of Duty Zombie Storyline Part 1.5. We're going to call this the Marine Extras. Now, I never really did an episode on the Marines and I always wanted to go back and do it, but there's not really a lot of info on them, which is kind of funny and ironic at the same time since they were the first ones to be in the zombie storyline. Um, but let's talk about the Marines for a second because it's, it's one of the most... Uh, I guess overlooked, most overlooked things in Call of Duty Zombie storyline. And in really in, in, in any Call of Duty Zombie game. After the first map, Nocturne and Toten, we had Veruk. And Veruk actually takes place when Tank Dempsey is trying to take Peter back from, you know, he was basically undercover at Veruk at the time. And they found out that he was a spy, that he was trying to spy on Group 935, uh, Peter. So Tank Dempsey was sent in with Marines. Now, I don't know if these Marines are the same marines from Nocturne and Toten, it's no details, but the end result is that Tank Dempsey was the only one that survived the mission to Veruk. He was the only one that survived and ended up coming back, which was then captured by Richtofen, and then he was experimented on, and that's how, you know, the form, Takyao, um, Tank Dempsey, all of them came together as a group because of these experimentations. Now before that, there was Nocturne and Toten. And the details on Nocturne and Toten is that Nocturne and Toten was the second outbreak. Now, when people first saw this, when they first heard of this from the radio message, they were like, where was the first one? So, in essence, the first outbreak was Origins. It's what we saw in the last, which is, again, a lot of irony here. It's ironic that the last map pack for Black Ops 2 was the beginning of the whole zombie storyline, which was the first outbreak at the excavation point that we all know already by now. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you can watch part 10 of my zombie storyline. It's, it's how it all started. That was the original outbreak. And then Nocturne and Toten was the second outbreak. And this all happens after Doris. But we never really talk about the Marines. They're kind of faded into the past. And even, even if you look them up, like if you look them up on Google and stuff, it'll just say unidentified Marines. But there's a few details about them that a lot of people missed. And, and we're just going to kind of go over that, go through the story. So the outbreak starts from the cutscene that we see. And in the cutscene... We see a plane that's crashed. We see someone who's kind of uh, just getting up from possibly being unconscious. And they get up at the right time because zombies start running at them. And they eventually start off in the map, which is where they're holding down the bunker. Uh, trying to survive the Night of the Dead, as it, as it is called. You know, it's basically what Nocturne and Toten means. So, it looks like they were Marines. They were on a plane of some sort. It comes down, it crashes, and they find themselves in enemy territory, uh, which is overrun by zombies. So this basically means that there was some sort of outbreak uh, in the middle of the war, World War II. There was some sort of outbreak at the front lines, and the German soldiers were infected by 115 and were turned into zombies. And we see the Allied forces, these Marines, who were possibly there, you know, just as soldiers. Their plane goes down and they end up seeing all these zombies and they're trying to kind of hold down the fort. Now, one of the interesting things is one of the quotes that they mention, the Marines themselves, which is ironic that a game mode that they thought was just going to be like a side thing and they never put any thought into it, uh, they ended up becoming like a huge story. But one of the quotes that they mention is, we're doing this for Peter. And Peter is actually one of the characters that you play in the World at War campaign. It's right at the beginning. He's only there for about a few seconds and he actually ends up dying. And I don't know if a lot of you guys played the World at War campaign. Uh, but in the campaign, when you wake up in the campaign, you see that there's this other soldier with you and he ends up getting killed. And then, you know, you escape and all that stuff. But that soldier who ends up dying, that Marine, is mentioned in the zombie uh, is one of the quotes which is kind of ironic that they know each other kind of weird you wake up in shock in the zombie storyline and you also wake up in shock in the campaign so it's kind of kind of cool maybe the marine that woke up there and saw that person die is one of the persons that's in, within the marines so that's about as much as we know on the marines at the moment uh, it's kind of sad that they're called un unidentified marines that they never mention them again in the storyline that's it they just kind of replace them and we're like you know, the four Marines never existed. It was just Takiao, Tank MC, Nikolai, and Richtofen. And it's a Richtofen. It's kind of sad that they kind of blurred them out and they don't exist anymore. And they just called them Marines. Uh, but, it, you know, it's kind of sad. If you guys ever want to play as them, you can go back and go play World of War, the original World of War, and play Knock Your Own Tone, and you'll see the actual 
Marines, not, you know, we're coughing in them. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's kind of sad, really. It's a short video talking about the Marines that are never mentioned after Nocturne and Toten. Slightly mentioned in Baruch, which we still don't know if they even survived uh, Nocturne and Toten, if they ever survived the outbreak of the zombies. It just kind of ends with you dying uh, in the actual game. But we never know if they survived or if anything happens to them. Maybe they'll pop up in Black Ops 3. We never know. Uh, but anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the Call of Duty Zombie Storyline. Uh, the extras, files, or whatever you guys want to call them. If you guys are new and have not already subscribed, remember to slap a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let's try to get to 600 likes. If we can get 600 likes, that would be awesome. And I'll release a new episode of my custom zombie storyline that I'm working on. Behind the scenes. Secret. Secret. Uh, but anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. I'm X-Rays. I'm out. Peace.